Right, so me, hat and shoes, you, speech. Let Suban keep retching to his chundering fresh air. Meet back in 20 minutes max, OK? You're really going to do this, aren't you, you maniac? You're actually going to marry Sophie and leave me on my own? Well, yes. I know why you're doing this, Mark. You're marrying her to spite me. Don't be ridiculous. This is you all over. You'd rather get married for the whole of your life than consider that maybe I might be right about something. Listen, Jeremy, just get yourself to an internet cafe to cut and paste some appropriate sentiments about me from the World Wide Web, OK? I'm not marrying out of spite. I'm marrying out of fear. There's a very big difference. Ugh, oh, this is not how I imagined it. Scrubbing my puke-stained wedding wear in a coffee shop toilet. Still, none of it's how I imagined it. Just wish I felt a tiny bit excited, not like I was marching to the gulag for an undetermined crime. God, look at her. I would break my own fingers just to spend one night with her. Ah, uh, Jenkins on Churchill. She is the perfect woman. Can I help you? Uh, can I get a filter coffee to take away? Sure. Anything else? Might as well ask. Yes. Will you marry me? Sorry? You probably don't want to. I just thought I'd check. Right. Um, no. I don't think so. OK. That's fine. No biggie. Can you give me some pair of shit out? No. God, no. It's, it's just... It, it's a Blackberry. Give us your phone. Give us your wallet. Come on! Before we fucking do you. Do me? Are they going to rape me? Oh, we did yours, Jez. Now it's time for mine. Oh, God. No. I mean... I don't feel very well. Can't we do it some other time? Cheers! We had a deal. 